In this video, I am teaching you how to make a um, brine solution for your driveway, which will prevent, not prevent, but slow the um, snow from adhering to your to the pavement. Um, so there are a few things you need. You need a uh, sprayer right here. You need salt. They say you can use pool salt. It's cheaper, but I just re regular um, salt for the driveway because that's what's available to me. And a measuring cup. And I use um, four cups of salt per one and a half gallon of water. And then you need a bucket to mix it in. You also need, I'm not sure if I said this, but boiling hot water. It's just going to make the mixing, the dissolving of the salt happen a lot faster. Okay, so once the water is boiling, you pour that into the bucket where the salt is. Um, my salt is already in there. And you stir it and stir it and stir it forever until the salt dissolves. And that's important because if the salt isn't dissolved properly, then it can clog up your sprayer, um, which is just a pain. So I'm going to pause it and then pour it in the water. Okay, so this next step is optional. I didn't do it the first time I created the brine solution, but what I'm going to do is I just now mixed the salt and the water, and I noticed that last time there were big chunks of salt still left in the bucket, and I don't want to clog my sprayer, so I'm going to pour the solution into another bucket through this sifter to sift out any large chunks, and from there I'm going to put that solution into the sprayer. Okay, so I guess that was kind of pointless because I hardly caught anything in the sifter, as you can see. Um, and the big chunks, they just stayed behind in the bucket. Okay, so I am going to add some ice to my solution just to help it cool down faster because you don't want to put piping hot water into a sprayer because it will build up way too much pressure. I made that mistake the first time and broke a part of my sprayer so this is just a little cheat and there it is I bet that's gonna melt real fast <laughs> so that first bit of ice melted real fast I'm gonna add another um, four cups right now it's still piping hot so now the solution is in the plunger um, but bef I mean in the sprayer, but before I put the plunger in, I'm just going to let it cool off even more outside. I put um, 12 cups of ice in there, but still it's kind of hot. So I'll be back later. Okay, so the last step is just putting the brine solution down on the driveway. I didn't record that, but this is the finished project. Product. It's supposed to be in streaks, just like you see on the road. I'm not sure what the point is of the streaks, but that's what I do, and it works. It's harder to see now. I'll try to go in the light. Still can't see. Oh, well, I think I got a pretty good shot at first. Here we are. Yeah, you can see the streaks. And that's it. So now tomorrow when it snows, our driveway will be nice and black and everybody else's will be covered in snow. You still have to shovel if you get a lot of snow, but this will make it so you don't have to shovel right away.